low blood pressure um we're going to be talking about low blood pressure the causes of low blood pressure what to do that's management of low blood pressure and how to know you have low blood pressure now low blood pressure in the medical terms it's called hypertension okay and it is when your blood pressure is less than 90 over 60. so this is what it means please listen attentively now the causes of low blood pressure it can be caused by due to pregnancy due to infection due to heart failure or heart issues dehydration like not taking enough water can cause low blood pressure now some certain medications okay most people are on some certain medication can cause low blood pressure for instance, if you're taking hypertensive, um, antihypertensive and it drops more than um, necessary and some other um, you know, medication can cause low blood pressure. Now, nutritional deficiency for those that are on extreme diet, they don't want to eat to lose weight and all and um, some nutritional um, issues. Okay, there are some people that have mental nutritional issues. Um, anorexia nervosa and anorexia bulimia okay and uh, these are the signs that may suggest that you're um you're having low blood pressure for instance fainting okay when you stand up you you're like you're feeling dizzy okay you're always tired please refer to that video of um signs of heart failure how to know your heart is failing and how to protect your heart there are two different videos make sure you watch that video i think i have it on my youtube page and also here uh, i think the full video is on my youtube page so um being tired fainting you're having episode of fainting your like your eyes turning when you stand up it could be autostatic hypotension these are signs that um, your blood pressure is low and then your blood pressure is less than 90 over 60. now on the treatment of low blood pressure it is very important first of all to know or management of low blood pressure very important to know that if you're having um low blood pressure make sure you consult with your doctor because people what works for someone else might be different and it now depends on what is causing yours it may be heart failure it may be medication that you're under okay so please make sure you meet your healthcare provider your doctor managing you to find out what is going on now however these are the tips that helps in managing low blood pressure number one drink a lot of water when you take a lot of water especially when you're in the house it increases your blood circulation okay so you have a lot of blood and the blood is you know it reduces its viscosity the blood is not too thick it makes it pump easily number two when they say um increase your salt intake you also have to be careful because now taking excess salt we all, all know if you're in this um page you all know the daily recommended salt intake you should take by now you should know if you're on this channel um which is um 2300 milligram equivalent to one teaspoon a day now if you're low on low blood pressure you can also st stick to the normal dose but you have to increase slightly and based on your condition okay because increasing excess sodium can also lead to heart issues okay so but you can increase gradually um eat reduce the way you take so um carbohydrate or eat small amount of food per time this is because when you eat food especially carbohydrates your blood pressure all the whole blood there's an increased supply of blood to your stomach okay to digest the food so your blood pressure goes down the more so you see when you eat a lot of food or a lot of carbohydrates it goes down so you eat bit by bit you know reduce it and um the, the way you eat at a time and then you reduce the way you take carbohydrates okay so you can um take um teas because they have caffeine you can take coffee depending on your condition but you know in normal amount take lots of water lots of teas you know the teas like milo and all i don't know the country you're watching from and uh, in the aspects of the salt, be careful you can increase your salt intake, but on no account should you put salt after eating food, you just add salt. Yes, that is that is a very bad one. Okay. So these are the things that will help you increase your blood pressure and also find out why you're having low blood pressure. Now, the, the next important thing to do is that 
when you are sitting try to elevate your leg a little when you're lying down on a cushion try to elevate your leg a little maybe with a pillow put you put it under your legs okay so that blood flow you know will get to your heart and all so um i hope this helps share this video i'm sorry it's so long and um make sure you're on my youtube channel share this video because somebody may benefit from it my name is nurse merit and i'm a nephrology nurse